Plebiodon is a genus of ramphorhynchid pterosaur from the Middle Jurassic Taint and Limestone Formation of Oxfordshire, England. Etymology <inaudible> 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 The type species of Clebiodon is Clebiodon rocher. The generic name Clebiodon means small cage tooth, from the Greek Clobion, Clobion, little cage, and Odin, Odin, tooth, in reference to the large anterior lanaries that appear to form a fish grab while the specific name Roche honors the comic book artist Nick Roche for his anatomically correct designs inspired by dinosaurs. <laughs> Discovery The holotype of Clebiodon roche, NHMUK PV Oregon, 47991, was first mentioned by George Robert Waterhouse 1878 as part of the collection of the British Museum of Natural History, who identified the specimen as Pterodactylus raptor, a name from an unpublished manuscript by Richard Owen. It had been donated by Robert Marsham. Richard Lidecker referred the specimen to Rampharynchus depressorostris listed by him as Rampharcephalus depressorostris. In their revision of pterosaur remains from the Great Oolite Group, Michael O'Sullivan and David Martel 2018 declared Rampharynchus depressorostris a nomen dubium at, Scaphognathini indeterminate, coining Clebiodon roche for NHMUK PV Oregon, 47991. A second specimen, OUMJ.28410, was referred to the species but only provisionally because it lacks the diagnostic teeth. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Description Clebiodon is one of the largest pterosaurs known from the Middle Jurassic. Its adult wingspan was estimated at 2 meters. The describing authors established a number of distinguishing traits. The lower jaw shows a unique combination of elongated front fang like lanaries with short and robust teeth in a more backward position. The teeth more to the rear are at least 1.3 times longer than their tooth sockets are wide. The rear lanary is at least 1.4 times and perhaps 2.4 times longer than the tooth to its rear which could be an only partially erupted replacement tooth. The longest lanaries are at least 1.5 times taller than the vertical thickness of the front tooth bearing lower jaw bone, the dentary. At its tallest point, the right lower jaw has a preserved length of 14 cm. To the front, it gradually curves to below. A piece at the front has broken off. The original length of the jaw including this piece was estimated at about 18 cm. The missing piece was assumed by the authors to have borne one additional tooth. The fossil shows four teeth, which then would have been the second to fifth. The second and third teeth are elongated, recurved and inclined to the front. Such teeth are called lanaries. The fourth and fifth teeth are noticeably shorter but almost as wide, giving them a robust appearance. They are also straighter, especially at their rear edges, and perpendicular to the jaw. Phylogeny 
Klebiadin was placed in the Ramfarinkadai in 2018. At several places in the describing article, a position in the Ramfarinkanai is suggested, but the authors eventually determine that it might also be member of the Scaphognathin I, concluding, Klebiadin Roche is therefore conservatively identified here as a member of the Ramfarinkadai rather than assigned to either subgroup. See also List of pterosaur genera Timeline of pterosaur research <laughs>